It is a welcome sight and sound every winter. Hundreds of thousands of migratory birds fill the skies of Indian administered Kashmir. Among them, geese, egrets, ducks and cormorants, all travelling thousands of kilometres from Eastern Europe, Japan and Turkey to feed and breed here. But the Himalayan wetlands are becoming less welcoming. It's always cold this time of year, but this year it's too harsh. It's making it difficult for the birds to find food on their own. We've started artificial feeding by giving them paddy grains. This winter, temperatures have dropped to minus 10 degrees Celsius. Wildlife officials are forced to break the ice on the wetlands before scattering paddy grain. They row their boats out onto the lakes to cover as much ground as possible. We work really hard to take care of birds, as these days the water surface at Hokesar freezes. We have to make a feeding pool. We spread the grain and try our best so that these birds don't starve. Around half a million migratory birds have visited the Hokesar wetland since November, but their numbers have declined in recent decades. Years of climate change and urban development are being blamed. Hokesar itself has shrunk from nearly 19 square kilometers in 1969 to 12.8 today. But the tense security situation in the area has made it difficult to address environmental issues in the Kashmir Valley, a region known as much for its natural beauty as the decades-long battle against Indian rule. Elizabeth Puranam, Al Jazeera, New Delhi.